They call me Squirrel. What's going on over here on the other side of Squirrel? You know, a little while back, my buddy Donald over on the Patreon server sent me over a piece by Haru Nimori. And uh, I listened to the piece, and the piece that he sent, um, so I didn't realize, first of all, that Haru makes all of her own music as well. So you hear her sing about all the music that's in the, that you hear. It's all music. That she creates all her own music. Um, but I was listening to it, and I was like, it was decent, but it was, it was tough for me because as an opening piece for an artist, I felt that the music overshadowed the vocal, and I couldn't hear her that well. And I wanted to give her a fair shot, so since I was kind of a little critical about just that I couldn't hear her, that's all, I didn't want you folks to experience her for the first time with me possibly, you know, painting a, a negative light. Not intentionally negative, but you know what I mean? Like, I didn't want to come across as negative about her. So Donald sent me over another piece. So that's this one. So I'm going to do this. This is Haru and the Mori, Seventh Heaven. I'm going to put this piece out, and then probably... Like the next day or whatever, I'll put out the first reaction. That way everybody can understand after they watch this one what's kind of going on, you know? Uh, and again, it wasn't a bad, like, I wasn't like, ah, oh, this sucks, it's horrible. I was just like, ah, I couldn't hear the vocal good, you know? Um, so I think this one's supposed to be, the vocal's supposed to be a little more prominent in this one. Um, Donald did, I asked him to send me another, another piece to give it a fair shot, and he did. So uh, that's what this one is. So this is Haru Namori. This is Seventh Heaven. So I'm going to shut up. We're going to spend four minutes listening to Haru, and then we'll talk about it afterwards. You guys ready? I think I'm ready. We should be ready. Here we go. <laughs>
Huh. All right. Well, I got to be honest. I enjoyed that much more than I enjoyed the first one. Um, and a lot of it had to do with that. I, I could hear her better, I think. I think that really was part of it. There, Even in this song, though, there were some parts where she was very, very low. Now that I understand, um, you know, Donald was explaining to me that she makes all the music, too. It might just be that she's proud of the music part of it, too, and she's trying to showcase both. I don't know. Uh, much more clear in this one. You can hear her a lot better. You'll see when I put the other piece out, if you end up watching both, I think you'll be able to see what I'm talking about. We'll not be able to hear that one very well. Uh, there was only a few lines in here that was kind of a little low for me, and the music was a little overpowering. But for the most part, though, you could hear her pretty, pretty, pretty good and uh, and very well, nice and clear. Uh, it had some subtitles down there, so I liked kind of getting the idea behind it, you know. Um, but yeah, good little song, um, and uh, and I'm glad that it showcased her talents a little better, so that we could have a, a fair shot at listening uh, to uh, Haru. So um, yeah, let me know what you think of Haru, and then uh, sometime probably over. Uh, the next couple of days, I'll put out the first piece. Uh, so, um, so take a look for that, and uh, we'll have that up on the channel for you too. As long as everything gets through. If not, then we'll put it up on Patreon for free. <laughs> you guys be good, all right? Take care. Scroll up. Hey, look, squirrel. That's what they call me. Proud American with roots in the UK. Can't you see? I love a good land.